Hey love, so it's your girl April and this is going to be a hair tutorial for my diva at K&K Fashions Boutique in Miami, Florida. So she has a hair site slash boutique, which means you can get your style on. And I will be doing a outfit of the day with one of her garments on, which I'm really excited about. So I will make sure to include that. So this time around, I decided to get three bundles of 16 inch Brazilian loose waves because I didn't need it too long and I didn't need it too short but I just wanted something average like this right here and this is actually not even Brazilian it's Malaysian my bad so my hair came like this and it's loose wave you girls already know like I am a huge loose wave fanatic so anyway and this is a synthetic lace for that I have one but so anyway yes this is the hair and it's gorgeous it looks so full this is like a lot of hair and like I said I got three bundles of 16 inches because I really didn't want it too long and hopefully it does get wavy because in a, in a way, it kind of reminds me of Body Wave and also it reminds me of Loose Wave. So we shall see how that goes. 14 inch Loose Wave closure, Malaysian as well. Very pretty. I love the baby hairs in the front. Even though I really don't use baby hairs, it, they're still really acceptable in the front. You know what I'm saying? And one of my faves, the reinforced sides, it doesn't have a lot of stretch. Like some of them I've noticed have stretch and some of them don't. But there's a lot of hair on this actual... Um, closure but it's very see-through like you can see through it like the knots are not like oh my god and the closure looks really decent like it's very 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 full like very full so it probably is going to need a little bit of tweezing because it's very full which means that the part is probably going to be thick and I need to thin it out a little bit. It's always nice. I like to support my peoples here in the United States, especially like my young sisters or, you know, young divas or what have you. And I'm like really, really hot because the lights are gleaming on me. I've had like this strong drink that my daughter has made me. And it's like on So, yeah, let's get into this video, you guys. Okay. Hey ladies, so I am done making this unit and I will be honest and tell you this like passed my expectations for wavy when I got the package or the hair before it was washed it just looked like body wave hair to me and it did say it was loose wave and I confirmed that by just rereading the email once I washed it and allowed it to air dry I just put it on a mannequin head and I allowed it to air dry when I came back like a few hours later she looked just like this hunties okay now if you haven't seen my recent video which which was how to tweeze and do a curve part that is provided for you girls below the link to that I do my um, tweezing and parts while the hair is wet meaning I will part the hair while the conditioner is in it and once I've rinsed it out I do I do go ahead and tweeze the part the hair is just a lot easier to remove from the actual closure when it's wet opposed to it being dry Sometimes when it's dry, it can snag on the actual closure and you may get a rip in it if you're tugging a little bit too hard. So I really suggest doing the tweezing if you're going to tweeze it while the hair is still wet. Always on a mesh spandex dome cap. We did put three combs instead of four this time because I really didn't need four. Sometimes I do go overboard. But for those of you who have asked me how do I get my closures to lay so flat, I don't make my wigs on a mannequin head like a styrofoam head or a plastic mannequin I use an actual wig block making head so that's um the reason why my closures lay flat and they fit properly instead of them being too tight too small or too big I use different size mannequin block heads now, I will do a video soon on how I sew my closures in I've already applied like a lighter concealer to the actual closure just to make the closure a lot brighter for the most part this week came out so pretty it is like the right length especially for summer hair you girls know i love me some wavy hair let's get this going and also if you see me in this top in a few other several videos it's because i have been super busy today dishing out all types of videos for you girls a lot of inexpensive synthetic lace fronts half wigs and wig videos so that is the reason why i have the same shirt on okay but yeah um let's get into this 
Okay, my love, so let's get into this video. It is super hot out here in Arizona, so I wanted something that wasn't so long and all over the place because, girls, it gets to like 120 degrees, and if you hear that wind blowing in the background, that is my fan spinning along with my AC on, too, because it gets really hot. So I'm just going to go ahead and play around with this. This hair is so pretty and soft, like I was really amazed, and the one thing that you see here in my hand is my strand maximizer hair filling fibers I use this religiously because I do have thinner edges so I try to blend in as best as I can and to top it off I do use my elf all over cover stick concealer in the color medium because this gives me like the perfect scalpage like you know what scalpage is when you want it to look like it's natural scalp. So I call it scalpage. And that's what it is. It's scalpage. And you always want to use like a small makeup brush to apply your concealer to your parts. Because you don't want to get concealer all over the place. So I'm going to go ahead and put me in a curved part to match my own natural hair. If you're interested in seeing how I do a curved part and how I tweeze my hair, I do have a video for that as well, which hopefully I don't forget to list down below. And if I do, just check on my channel. It's fairly new. It's probably like three weeks old um, on my channel. So all you have to do is basically look up how I tweeze and curve my parts. But yes, I'm going to go ahead and spray some more of that strand maximizer. That stuff really does help, girls. So if you have thin edges and they're too thin to where you feel self-conscious, get you some strand maximizer or some topic. Either one is the same thing. They look like tiny little hairs. So I'm going to go ahead and fluff this baby on up. She is like the perfect summer length hair. And I am so happy that it really waved up because from the looks of it, I really didn't think it was going to look like this. But this is like wavy and it goes so well with like my nudish shirt nudish summer sweater whatever you want to call it i absolutely love this sweater um i just did a lookbook so i'll have that video up soon but yes check her out check k and k fashions boutique out to you guys she has some great hair Hey loves all done so this is like the perfect length for the summertime this is like summer beachy wave hair or whatever you want to call it it's very wavy and i'm very impressed with that but the hair is like so damn soft, like butter, buttery soft. This is some really good hair. So I will give it to um, K and K Boutiques. They have some really, really affordable hair as well as the gloss, the lustrous of it, the texture of it. It's really pretty hair. Now I did not use all of the bundles. I don't think I did. Um, I think I had like, geez, probably like. A quarter of a bundle left because all of the lengths were the same you know the 16 inches I just wanted something all 16 inches though I could have went even shorter and did like 14 inches but I really don't like to go that short um, because I love wavy hair but it did shed a little bit when washing it when conditioning it but yeah I didn't put a deep conditioner in it just regular conditioner and I did the norm like always but I'm very impressed with their hair it is super soft and really pretty nothing too long but the waves are popping like seriously popping waves popping okay so yes ladies yes i will post all of the information as well as that as check them out because they do have really affordable clothing for us plus size divas as well as non-plus size divas right, ladies i hope you guys enjoyed this video i will post all the information below like i stated stay diva and divalicious make sure you rate comment subscribe thumbs this video up and i'll see you girls and guys on my next video